What should our city look like in 10, 20 or 30 years time? Will it have enough capacity to meet the city and the state's aspirations for growth and still retain its character? The City of Adelaide has created a 3D model as a key tool to assist in planning for the city's future. The current model is still in development and shows different levels of detail, which will be improved over time. As a dynamic and growing city, Adelaide's skyline has changed dramatically over the last 10 years. The City of Adelaide's strategic plan envisages further change with an increase in the city's permanent residential population of 1,300 people per annum, an increase in over 700 students per annum, and a total increase in the number of city workers to 125,000 by 2012. The 3D model can be used to display scenarios and assist in answering questions such as, what will Adelaide look like if the population doubles to 50,000 in 2027 as forecast? Do building height controls need to be changed to accommodate the expected population? And how can development respect the city's valuable heritage buildings? The model will enable us to visualise future growth scenarios, help architects and designers to prepare their buildings in a simulated city environment, assess how new buildings fit into the city, illustrate where heritage buildings and other important facilities are, and assist in community debate. There is considerable development potential in the city, arising from height increases from changes to the 2006 development plan, much of it currently underutilised. The proposed new Royal Adelaide Hospital development will further foster regeneration of the city's northwest. Sites with the potential for redevelopment can be identified. As an example, this block contains a number of sites ripe for redevelopment. This is what it could look like if built to development plan heights. The plan also allows overheight buildings under certain circumstances. Sites such as these can be redeveloped over the next 30 years to enable the targets in the draft 30-year plan for Greater Adelaide to be met. These draft targets envisage an additional 43,000 workers and an additional 16,300 residents over the next 30 years in the city. One example of a redevelopment is the bus station site. The city also has many valuable heritage buildings, which can be retained while also allowing further development potential. An example being the Tivoli development in the city's east. The model can also be used to depict concepts for potential urban design projects, such as options for future tram routes. The draft 30-year plan for Greater Adelaide illustrates an option for a mass transit loop through the city. Urban design changes associated with the River Torrens can also be modelled. What could a footbridge over the River Torrens 
from Elder Park to the South Australian Cricket Ground look like? To assist development assessment, the model can illustrate proposed developments for existing buildings and surrounding areas. Or display a new building from different viewpoints and consider what shadow the building may create. The vision for the city is to be a vibrant, populous and sustainable capital city built upon Adelaide's heritage and lifestyle. This model will assist wider community debate and understanding on how the city can be developed and enhanced in order to realise the vision. The Adelaide City 3D model will be available to the public in a dynamic online 3D environment as of today.